And when they ask for your order, I want you to sing the whole thing. I'm hoping it's disgusting. Go to a restaurant and pick the spiciest thing on the menu. Eat baby food for the whole day. Sit and eat it on the floor. Walk around in public with no shoes on. This is your look for the day. Get on like all fours and then start like making horse sounds. I just think that would be really humiliating. <laughs> I'm in shock. I'm sorry. I need a minute. Oh my god. I can see it. Oh my god. That was horrible. I can't look her in the face. I think you should get a tattoo. <laughs> Hi guys, so I've already filmed the whole video. I'm just making the intro now It's been a very long week, but I got tiktokers to control my whole week I think there's like 14 tiktokers in this video that controlled my week and I had to do some horrible things Let me tell you. But anyway, I hope you enjoy the video and my suffering Okay, it's day one and I'm very scared to start opening these videos from tiktokers The first person that's gonna give me something to do is Darcy Angel. She's so lovely So I hope she's given me something nice. Hi Holly I hope you're okay. So I want you to go to your nearest drive through It can be any company. And when they ask for your order, I want you to sing the whole thing. It'll be so funny. And I'm really excited to see. It'll be funny, will it? <laughs> I hope it is because otherwise I'm just doing this for no reason. She wants me to sing. I can't sing anyway, let alone ordering a Starbucks. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna bring my sunglasses with me because I feel like when I've ordered at the window, then I have to go around and pay. I can't let them look me in the eye after singing in the drive through window. So I feel like this will make me look a bit more normal. Actually, would this make it worse? I'm so nervous, but let's go to Starbucks drive through Why am I so scared? It's not even that bad. I'm sure we've got worse yet to come. Oh my God, I'm next. No, I look crazy with the glasses on. Hi, can I get a vanilla ice latte, please? Yeah, what size would you like? <laughs> a small, please. Anything else you can say? That's it, thank you. Thank you. <gasps> I've turned my car off. I've turned my car off. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. Is my face red? I turned my car off because you can obviously hear the engine So I just wanted it to be quieter when I was ordering but then it meant I couldn't have a quick getaway And I was still sat there when I watched that back It probably won't even sound like I sang but I was really trying but it just didn't come out like a song I really tried if it didn't sound like a song that's on you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, thank you, Darcy, for controlling that part of my day. At least I got a coffee out of it. The next TikToker controlling my day is Grace. Her name is also More Grace on TikTok. Let's see what she's chosen me to do next. Please be something nice. Okay, Holly, this could be really easy or really disgusting for you. I'm hoping it's disgusting, um, but I want you to go to the Costa drive through and order a tuna melt panini because that is my personal fave and yeah let me know what you think of it oh i'm in shock i'm sorry i need a minute tuna tuna i can't i've never had tuna in my life and i never planned to i just can't get past the smell of tuna oh my god no at least i don't have to do anything embarrassing but this is disgusting to me like this is one of my worst nightmares i'm not gonna lie like this might be dr really dramatic but i know i'm gonna hate it grace you've really done me dirty here hi can i have a tuna melt panini please well at least i didn't have to sing my order this time this is for you grace thank you for telling me to get this I'm so hungry and I probably won't be able to eat it. Oh my god, I just got a massive whiff of tuna. I'm being so dramatic. Oh my god, I can see it. Ooh, I've actually got shivers. I'm oh. oh it stinks. It stinks. Oh my god. Cheers. Tuna does not go with coffee. Let me just tell you that now. That was really not a nice experience. This is so dramatic for no reason. If you like tuna, comment below. This is up there with one of the worst things I've ever tasted. <laughs> oh, I've had this much. Is that good? Right, next controlling my day is Emily Jade. 
I hope she gives me something nice, please. Hi, Holly. So what I'd like you to do is go to a restaurant and pick the spiciest thing on the menu. I'm so sorry if you don't like spice, but I know you didn't ask for two things, but after, go and treat yourself and go to the cinema and watch a film. So it ended nicely, but the spiciest food? Okay, so I think I'm gonna go to Nando's and get the spiciest thing that they have on the menu. And then we're gonna go to the cinema to end this day off in a positive way. It's the spiciest it can be, and we've also got the hottest sauce. I usually have lemon and herb, so this is like really big for me. Ooh. It's not that bad, but my tongue is really spicy. It's not, it's not that bad. Oh, that was worse. Oh, no. oh god. Okay, it's a bit later now. I'm back from Nando's in the cinema. Thank you, Emily, for giving me kind of nice ones. The next person we've got a video from is Crystal Wright. She also makes sketch videos on TikTok. She sent me a very long video, so I'm slightly scared for this one. Afternoon, Holly. Crystal here, and I've decided to design your day. I've thought long and hard about this. Um, you're gonna wake up at 4 a.m. sharp and go for like half an hour walk. Be well nice. Okay, I'm just gonna stop the video there. So I'm gonna have to start the day that Crystal's planned for me tomorrow because obviously she's told me to wake up at 4 a.m. Firstly, I don't usually go to sleep until 4 a.m. So I'm gonna have to have an early night tonight. Mm, look at the time. Yes, I'm on FaceTime because me and my boyfriend sleep on FaceTime. But this is to prove I'm not lying. Like it's actually 4 a.m. Yes, I have no notifications. I can't believe I have to get up now and go for a walk. <laughs> it's literally 4am. I mean, it's actually spitting. I'm actually wearing my pyjama bottom still as well. This was a lovely start to my day. So it's now 11am and I've been up since 4am. Now I'm ready to see what else Crystal has planned for my day today. I want you to wear your clothes inside out for the whole day. All right. Like includes hats, socks, gloves, like anything. Any clove item inside out. Uh, I want you to eat baby food for the whole day. Nothing but baby food. And then maybe in the afternoon you could go to town or something like that just so everyone can see you wearing your clothes inside out. Bit embarrassing, but don't worry about it. And if you see someone eating like a bag of crisps, some sweets, some chips, only then can you, you can go over to them and you can ask them if you can have one of their chips. But, you know, you can't buy it yourself. If you want to eat normal food, someone else, you have to eat it from someone else's plate, basically. Job done. I don't mind what time you go to sleep. I'll leave that down to you, okay? Um, <laughs> so I have to wear my clothes inside out. I have to eat baby food all day and only baby food. And then I have to steal food from someone else's plate. I actually had plans today to go for a roast dinner with my boyfriend. <laughs> well, I'm obviously going to still go, but my boyfriend will be having the Sunday roast and I'll be having baby food. There's so much to choose from. Where do I start? I can have these ones as like little snacks. Oh my God, they all look so gross. And then the actual pots for my main meals. Oh my God. I just went out to get, I think I got too much. <laughs> I actually got really nice ones. I'm actually excited to try these. And then this is the only one that I think is gonna be gross. Sweet potato and tender chicken. That's gonna be my lunch instead of my Sunday roast. But I'm gonna have one of these now for my breakfast. It's like a really thick smoothie. That's so nice. I'd really recommend this, you know? <laughs> I finished it. Thank you, Crystal, for such a nice challenge. Let's get my clothes on inside out now. I've got my cargoes on. These are the pockets on the outside. This is the inside of the logo, if you can see. <laughs> Obviously, Crystal's challenge is now carrying on for the whole day, but I've just had a video from Aoife. I want you to go into a coffee shop of your choice maybe starbucks wherever's easier get a coffee get some food and sit and eat it on the floor of the coffee shop the floor uh where everyone can see you as well slay have fun i think i need new friends <laughs> i'm really not looking forward to this day <laughs> I'm so jealous of this. Okay, well, my boyfriend's got his roast dinner and here is my lunch. This is sweet potato and chicken and baby food. I don't even have a, a spoon. Mm. 
Well, that was my lunch. That was very nice. <laughs> Um, excuse me, I was just wondering, are you, are you done with that? Because I can only eat baby food all day unless I eat something off your, like a stranger's plate. I mean, I can get you food if you like. Oh, no, no, it's okay. I just, could I just have what's left? Thank you. Sorry if that was really weird. That's all right. Oh my God, that was, that was so embarrassing. And this is my meal. This is what I got. Right, we've had our lunch. I've had my baby food. I do still have my clothes on backwards, by the way, but I just put this on because it's cold when I got in the car. Okay, so the next TikToker giving me something to do is Millie. Let's see if she gives me something nice to finish the day. Hi, Holly. Thank you so much for asking me to do this. Okay, today I think you should go to the cinema. I don't know what films are on, so I can't tell you what film to watch, but pick a film and go to the cinema because it's fun. Okay. Bye. That was such a nice one. Everyone else is giving me such horrible ones. I think I'm gonna go and watch Scream 6 again. I only just saw it a few days ago, but it was really good and Scream is one of my favorite movie franchises, so. Oh, <laughs> we're the only people in here. <laughs> That's one of the best ones. <laughs> so I had a really good end to my night yesterday. Thank you, Millie, for telling me to go to the cinema. Today, we're back to the bad ones, though, I think. <laughs> First, we have got Victoria, my Pisces sister, and we're gonna see what she's got planned for my day. Hey, Holly. Um, thank you for giving me some control over your day. Um, so this is what I want you to do today. I want you to go to any charity shop that you can find and pick out the ugliest possible thing like the most ugly thing that is there um and you have to buy it and you have to wear it for the rest of the day okay i'm going to the dermatologist today to have my skin treatment and i'm gonna have to wear the ugliest thing from the charity shop look at my top i just think it's beautiful honestly there weren't that many ugly ones i'm not gonna lie i was picking between like four but i was still thinking they're not that ugly it's actually really hot today so it's a good day for a nice little summer t-shirt i've still got one of my baby food things in here from yesterday that i finished these were so nice I, i'm honestly recommending them to you i just come out of my dermatologist appointment so the lovely nancy is controlling my day next i hope she gives me something food related because i'm really hungry hey holly so i want you to go to a drive through and order something from a different drive through so if you go to mcdonald's order something off of the kfc menu um if you go to a starbucks drive through order something from costa you know what i mean like the opposite one <sighs> right let's go to mcdonald's i'm really nervous for this one you know hey can i take your order please hi do you do zinger burgers sorry what do you do zinger burgers no Oh, could I have a um, McCrispy meal, please? Oh my God, he was so annoyed. That was horrible. Then he was fine after, like when I started ordering my meal. <laughs> but he knew, he knew that I was pranking him. Play that back again. Hi, do you do Zinger burgers? Sorry, what? Do you do Zinger burgers? No. Oh, he literally was like, sorry, what? <laughs> and then I asked again and he was just like, no. Oh my god, that was horrible! That was horrible! Ah! But then it was so weird because I just carried on my order normally, like I hadn't just said that. This is honestly the longest week of my life doing this challenge. Okay, so the next TikToker controlling my day is my best friend, Kian Tamblin. I'm very scared to see what he wants me to do. And I know he'll do me dirty. Hello everyone. <laughs> so my dearest and best friend, Holly Lang, has asked me to pick something to control her day. Now if there's one thing we know about you, Holly, is that you like your makeup to be subtle natural not too obvious well today we're going to change that we are flipping the script ladies and gentlemen are you ready holly boom this is your look for the day yeah weren't expecting that were you for all of today holly you are going to be doing your makeup like a british school chav i'm talking the thick slug eyebrows extreme highlighter foundation that clearly does not match that is the key here your foundation cannot match you for reference here's another one a fake eyelash here and there if you have these hoop earrings and the coat, even do that. Now the hair, I would prefer it to be in a bun, but I'm not sure if your hair can do that. If not, then try and make it look like this. But yeah, this is your look for the day. I've really done you dirty here. So, I guess we'll do my makeup now. Oh. Oh dear. Oh, that feels so wrong. I'm terrible at putting fake eyelashes on. I can't do it. 
Uh. I mean, they are so wonky and not on properly, but that's the best we're gonna get. This is really scary. So the next person giving me something to do today while I look like this is the beautiful Lydia from Casa Amor on Love Island this year. Hi babe, I hope you're well. Firstly, thank you so much for asking me to do this. I am buzzing. And right, what I would like you to do today is, obviously I am a Scottish girl. I feel like it's only fair to get you to do something Scotland related. So I would like you to either go to the shops and buy yourself some Scottish food and drink. So get yourself some haggis, get yourself a canine brew and taste test it if you've not tried it before. Or if you're not keen on that, I'd like you to go to a drive through of your choice and place your order in a Scottish accent. I am so buzzing to see what you decide to do. I can't wait. Okay, that wasn't that bad. I'm terrible at accents, honestly. I don't want to butcher the Scottish accent. So Lydia did say that I can choose either one. I can go to a drive through or I can try some Scottish food and drink. So I think I'm just going to go to the corner shop and get an iron brew and I'll try it because I've literally never tried it before. Oh no, you can go, it's fine. Okay, I've got my iron brew. I tried to hide my face as much as I could when I was in that shop. But a lady started speaking to me. She was nice though. She obviously, she didn't give me any weird looks or anything. Anyway, that's really nice. What is the taste meant to be? Because it does taste like some sort of sweets. Let me just try the Scottish accent quickly. I'm not going to the drive through to do it, but let me try it. Iron brew... It sounded okay in my head, but it definitely wasn't. Well, thank you, Lydia, for choosing that part of my day. Okay, so the next TikToker controlling my day is Craig. He also does retail sketches on TikTok. Hey, all, how's it going? So what I want you to do is for either breakfast, lunch, or dinner, you get to choose. Go to any drive through any fast food drive through Again, I'll let you choose. And order a meal without using the letter E. Okay, you cannot use the letter E in any of the words you use while you're ordering that meal. And you also can't explain that you can't use the letter E. I don't know how you do that, but you can't do that either, okay? That's cheating. Good luck. Okay, how do I order something without using the letter E? If I ask for a chicken nugget meal, does that have an E in it? Yes. Six chick nug mal. And then to say please, I have to be like, please. <laughs> and I want to order a Coke though, but I can't pronounce it as Coke. It will have to be cock. <laughs> if I ordered it in an accent though, it might sound normal. If I did like a northern accent, then I could be like, can I have a cock? <laughs> Hi, can I have two chick nugs, please? <laughs> I asked for two, not six. No, that's it, thank you. I can't look her in the face. And you. So I'm actually going to London today and Nikki Lily has chosen me something to do while I'm in London. So I'm very scared to open her video. Hey Holly, okay, so. I challenge you to walk around in public with no shoes on. Sorry, love you. Okay, well, let's go to London. A lady's looking at me. She's actually staring. I can't blame her. I would too. She's telling her husband. So it's the day after London and I realized I didn't actually fully do the challenge, I don't think, because I was at an event and I think I just forgot to do it. Like there were like Love Islanders everywhere. <laughs> I couldn't walk around with no shoes on. So just let me off that one, okay? So first we've got some videos from Olivia Duffin, who's going to be controlling my day first. Today you to go into Westfield or any big shopping center in your pajamas a massive dressing gown and fluffy socks. <laughs> I also dare you to go through Starbucks drive through and get my all-time favourite drink, which is a caramel macchiato, extra hot. Um, we ask for frothy milk, so they froth it. Um, extra caramel drizzle, whipped cream, but if they ask for milk, you have to give them full fat milk. I don't like hot coffee. I don't like cream. I don't like caramel. It's not a great day for me. Hi, can I have a caramel macchiato, please? Can I have that with extra caramel drizzle and whipped cream, please? I'm wearing my pajamas, by the way, if you could not tell. This is the first time I've had a hot coffee in my life. I mean, if you liked caramel and whipped cream, which I don't, you would love this. You know what, it's actually not bad. It just tastes like a normal iced coffee. 
but it's hot. Thank you, Olivia. This is actually quite nice. I feel really cozy because I'm wearing my pajamas and I've got my hot coffee. The next TikToker choosing what I do today is Belle Priestley. Hi, Holly. Thank you so much for asking me. So, I've been thinking long and hard and I'm going to do something a bit out there, a little bit scary, but I think you should get a tattoo. Um, I have eight and it's the best thing I've ever done. They're so cool. Well, I think they're cool anyway, hopefully. Um, but yeah, I think you won't regret it. I mean, I'm not going to tell you what to get because I think that's a bit like, a bit too extreme. But yeah, get a tattoo. I can't wait to see what you get um, if you do get it. And yeah, bye. Have fun. I actually can't believe that. I mean, this video took a turn. <laughs> this video has gone from like trying a tuna melt panini to getting a tattoo. I actually already have 41 or 42 tattoos. I'm always looking to get more anyway. So I'm actually really glad that Belle asked me to do this. And I'll also have to wear my pajamas. <laughs> Wow, you're cool. There's like some kids, they're probably like 12, riding their bikes just in the road. What are they doing? <gasps> they actually don't care, they do not care. They are riding straight in front of the cars coming into the car park. Let's go and get my tattoo, I guess. <laughs> so obviously while I was in there I did have to take my dressing gown off because I was getting the tattoo on my arm I've still got my pajama bottoms on I actually wore these into the tattoo studio as well It is a bit bloody at the moment so it looks a bit weird But it's a heart with devil horns but the devil horns look really dodgy at the moment because of the blood on it But I'm very happy with it so thank you Belle for making me get a tattoo today Today is the last day that tiktokers will be controlling my week I'm so glad this week is over I'm actually going to Alton Towers tomorrow for an event so you'll see another vlog about that soon and the lovely Mia Fears is going to be choosing what I do at Alton Towers so I thought I would open her video now so I'm prepared for tomorrow. Hi Holly, um, I was really trying to think of something different and creative for this and I thought long and hard and uh, I really hope you don't hate me. <laughs> so I was thinking if you've been in like a party shop, I'm sure they must sell them on like Amazon and stuff as well. There's these like rubber horse heads. I'll send you a picture of one. I think you should get one of those, wear it, go out to a really busy place in public and then get on like all fours and then start like making horse sounds. I just think that would be really humiliating. Yeah. I'm gonna do that at Alton Towers. Well, let me just order a horse head real quick. Well, that's going straight in my basket. Well, I guess I'll see you tomorrow at Alton Towers. <laughs> Look at the little girl's face. She was so scared. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing. My most sincere apologies. I seem to have not got on all fours and made a horse noise, which was the whole point in the challenge. So I'm very sorry, Mia, to disappoint you, but I hope that what I did was enough. And finally, the week has come to an end. It was such a long week, honestly. I really hope you enjoyed this video because I put a lot of effort into it. Thank you again to all the TikTokers that took part. It was so fun. If this video gets 1,000 likes, I am gonna post a part two. I don't know why I wanna put myself through this again, but maybe Make sure you leave a like and subscribe because there will be more videos like this coming soon. So I'll see you next week.